What's up guys and welcome back to another Apex Legends video. Man oh man, I am so excited. Just a few moments ago they announced that the Season 1 Battle Pass starts tomorrow. Let's go baby! Oh, I've been really enjoying this game over the course of the past few weeks as I'm sure a lot of you guys have and uh... I it just like it was starting to get a little bit tedious. Like, I, I'm, I'm not gonna lie I feel like Fortnite has really spoiled us And I don't think any game is ever gonna be able to keep up with Fortnite with the amount of updates that they have and changes and new weapons and vehicles and everything else But uh, like it, it has been like a month now. We hadn't really heard anything about the battle pass So I was getting a little bit worried, but uh, Respawn stayed true to what they promised They said it was gonna be coming out in March and it officially comes out tomorrow So make sure you guys stay tuned for some videos now uh, on their website They actually have some more information about the past We get a little sneak peek at some of the skins and even some of the other things we can earn Pretty much the entire battle pass is shown on their site So we're gonna take a look at that today and see what we're gonna get into tomorrow all right guys, so as you all could see wild frontier is gonna be our theme for this first battle pass Which sounds kind of kind of interesting. We've got like a kind of like a weird skull head dinosaur looking thing in the background there I don't know we'll have to wait and see what happens But uh, as you guys can see here, it's gonna work pretty much identical to Fortnite both in terms of price and in terms of features So you can get the normal battle pass for 950 apex credits And that's gonna work just like a battle pass where as you level up you get an unlock and, and special rewards and stuff for each level Or you can start off by getting the battle pass bundle for 2800 apex credits where you get the battle pass along with the first 25 levels automatically unlocked. So it's kind of like a little head start there. Now, if we get into some of the rewards and stuff, you guys can see here, these are the Wild Frontier skins. Instantly unlock the Lifeline Revolutionary skin, the Wraith Survivor skin, the Mirage Outlaw skin with the purchase of the Battle Pass. So, I mean, these... I'm gonna be honest, I'm not like super crazy psyched on them. They don't look bad. Like, they, 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 they fit with the theme, I guess, but I... I don't know. There's just like a little bit of face paint and some different colors. I was hoping to see something a little bit better, but we'll have to wait and see when we get into all of the Battle Pass rewards. So you guys can see, earn over 100 unique items throughout the season. Everything you snag before the season's over is yours to keep. Now they do have a fact down here, and basically once the Battle Pass is over, you can't earn the stuff anymore. Anything you do earn, you get to keep going on into forever. And uh, then also, there is a free pass. You don't have to buy the battle pass. You can unlock one Wild Frontier Legend skin, five Apex packs, and 18 Wild Frontier stat trackers based on the free section of it. So you don't have to buy the battle pass if you don't want. There's still stuff for you to be able to do. But um, that's, you know, obviously the battle pass is kind of where it's at. So we're going to go through here. We're going to check out everything we can get. So looks like we've got some, some you know, character skins here at, at tier one. We've got weapon skin. Uh, tracker, weapon skin, some sort of an emblem or something. We've got intros. Let's check check out what else is going on. Well, what just happened? Disappeared on us for some reason, but we're back here. Anyway, we've got uh, Apex. Oh, that's cool. So you can earn Apex credits as you're leveling up, just like you can earn V-Bucks from the Battle Pass. We've got more trackers, a pretty cool looking weapon skin there for the Prowler. I don't know what this is. Do you guys know what that is? I I'm not sure. I think it's some sort of an emblem or like a... a Thing you can display. I, I have no clue. Apex credits, XP, um, tracker, weapon skin. Not really looking all that great on that weapon skin, to be honest. Uh, intro, apex credits, weapon skin, XP. Okay, so it's looking like... Ooh, look at this. What is that? This could be like a, a guaranteed epic or better item, like a purple or better item, because it's all covered in purple. But that looks way different than the normal apex packs that we open. Uh, I don't know. That's that's kind of interesting. That that looks interesting. But yeah, more trackers and weapon skins. Some of these. I mean, is that like it? Is that like an ivory, like a bone ivory or something? I guess that would kind of fit with the um, the theme of the season. More XP, apex credits. All right, looking looking pretty good. Not too bad. Not kind of like some tribal camos and stuff. All right. Ooh, level forty eight. Bro. So Octane is the new uh, legend that's coming to the game tomorrow. We've seen leaks and, and like even some of his jump pads have shown up in the game recently. His ultimate ability is like this crazy jump pad looking thing that allows you to like, you know, traverse and jump and, and get up high and whatever else. And then he also has, I believe he, he heals over time, but he can also change health points 
for speed, which is kind of interesting. I don't know, he, he sounds pretty interesting, but this must be kind of like the, the themed version of him for the Battle Pass, which is kind of cool. So you get that at 48. Ooh, that's a good looking Prowler right there. Kind of like some shiny gold. Looks like you get an orange one. I, I, don't, I don't know what those are. We're gonna have to find that out tomorrow. Obviously not everything we're gonna know so far. I'm hoping they have some, some uh, exciting surprises and stuff for us. Um, but overall, looking like, you know, obviously you have the character skins. Apart from that, there's a lot of Apex credits, a lot of, of random weapon skins along with, uh, with trackers you could unlock. And it looks like there's kind of like the same themed skins that, that go around to all the weapons. Um, it's, it's not bad. Ooh, tier 100. Look at that bad boy, bro. I don't really like the Havoc that much, but that looks pretty cool, I'm not gonna lie. And uh, that's the end of the Battle Pass there. So, uh, I, I don't know. We're gonna check all this stuff out in-game tomorrow. Obviously, I'm gonna go through. I'm gonna get the Battle Pass. I'm gonna check everything out, show it to you guys, that sort of thing. Uh, it doesn't look bad. It, it's not as good as Fortnite, though. I, I'm just gonna be straight up honest with you guys. Like, I, I love the game, but this, this Battle Pass is not nearly as good as Fortnite's battle passes. And Fortnite's most recent battle pass was the, the worst one they've had in a while, in my opinion. But just in terms of like character skins and stuff, like, bro, we, we can do better than this. But uh, that's that's just my opinion, I guess. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know what you guys think. I'm excited to check this thing out. I'm excited to have something to grind for. Excited to have something new added into the game. And uh, I know, you know, like I said, we're getting the brand new legend. We're getting some some reworking and balancing and stuff like that. So it's uh, it's gonna be a fun day. So I'm gonna see you guys tomorrow. Hope you guys enjoyed. Drop a like if you did. Subscribe if you haven't already. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments. Peace out.